Katana was a member of a group called the Outsiders. And the Outsiders were a group of heroes that Batman put together after he left the Justice League. And Katana probably has grown to be the most popular out of the new characters that were introduced in that group. Her soul sword, it's called, traps the souls of anyone it kills. It was once used by her husband, and her husband was killed by it. his souls trapped inside that sword. So a big element of Katana is talking to that sword, communicating with her husband. She's a samurai, and I think of Amanda Waller and Rick Flagg as my lord. You don't question your lord when you're a samurai, you just do and you serve your entire life protecting them. And she is very loyal, and she'd do anything to fulfill the mission, whatever it was, just because that's what Amanda Waller wanted. The physicality of that character and the sword fighting, everything that the katana needed to be was incredibly important. It was also important to have her be played by a Japanese actor. And Karen really doesn't have a resume. She really doesn't have a history as an actor, but sometimes as a director, you just go on instinct. So you can land and pull it. She was a huge surprise, and it was fantastic to just watch her grow and develop and really become Katana. <laughs> So much of her character comes from her martial arts background and her katana skills. So it helped a lot to go through the fitness training during pre-production. Physically looking like the character helped, but also being able to do all of the moves and go through all of the action on my own, that's when it felt like I was truly becoming katana. Her soul sword traps the souls of anyone it kills. And it's been around for a long, long time. Katana Soul Taker. It was actually one of my favorite experiences of the movie, and it was a complete surprise. It's extremely authentic looking. We'd look at sort of historic references to the different emblems and insignia on that. I was so worried about hitting someone with my sword that I went through a lot of rehearsal time and a lot of practice on my sword fighting. Katana, being the samurai warrior that she is, she can do it without taking a breath. She also has this little writing on her thigh, and it says, my sword sheds blood. So I think that's pretty cool.